Yo, 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 what up YouTube, it's Enid here from Neanderthal Fitness, www.neanderthalfit.com Personal trainer, fitness instructor, YouTube, talk at the camera dude. So today's video, I'm bringing you a product review. Um, I've only done one of these before, but uh, you know, I'm not endorsed by anyone, I'm not paid to do these, but when I find a product that I'm quite excited about, I like to put a video out there so that other people can find and enjoy the product. So what are we talking about today? It's not another shaker bottle. It is not really fitness related, but you guys know I'm big on the paleo diet, paleo lifestyle. So check it out. We got some breakfast cereal here. This shit is blowing up. Okay, so let's check out what we got here. Cocoa and hazelnut, grain-free granola by the Paleo Foods Company. All right, so this stuff I'm gonna to talk to you real quick about why I love this gluten and wheat free. Okay, so I bought this stuff. I got it from a place called the Whole Food Market or the Whole Food Supermarket. It's something we have around here. I guess there are more of them around the country and I haven't seen anywhere else that stocks this bad boy, but I should imagine if you visit the uh, Paleo Foods Company website, you can probably order it. Now, this was not cheap. It was near enough six pounds for a box which only contains 340 grams. Um, you can buy like value bran flakes or corn flakes or something like that for what like less than two pound for a kilo definitely less than two pound for 500 grams so this shit is expensive no doubt however it is literally just a nutritional powerhouse i'm going to talk to you about the ingredients of this bad boy okay so um what what is in here i gotta find the ingredients it must say it's somewhere here, surely. Uh, da -da -da -da. Oh, man, guys. Sorry about Oh, <laughs> it's, a, it's a big panel here. It tells you all the ingredients. Okay, so we got almonds. <coughs> we got cashew nuts. We got shredded coconut, like dried coconut. We got Brazil nuts. We got pumpkin seeds. We got hazelnuts. We got cocoa nibs. We got chai seeds, everybody's big about the chai these days. We got a little bit of natural honey, and we got some ground cocoa for the chocolatiness. So I'll kind of show you, there's only a tiny bit left. You guys can see it's chocolatey colored. So all the nuts and coconut and everything is coated in cocoa. So it's got a chocolatey taste. Uh, the honey binds bits together, so it's a bit like granola, but there is no wheat, no nothing in here. So there's no gluten, no grains, no vegetable oils, no refined sugars no oats, nothing artificial. Um, per your average serving is 42 grams, which means the box is eight servings, but realistically for me, I eat at least 100 grams or more in a serving, but let's talk about what they suggest, 42 grams serving, 20.6 grams of fat, man. Fat's awesome, fat's good for your nerves, fat's good for your hormones, fat's good for your skin and your hair. Everybody's afraid of fat, don't be afraid of fat. Fat's where we should be getting a lot of our calories and energy from. That being said, there's not a lot of anything else. Um, you've got uh, only 5.8 of those are saturates, by the way. 6.9 grams of carbs, of which five are sugar. So very little sugar, very little carbs. 3.6 grams of fiber, 7.4 grams of protein, which, you know, if you combine it with 250 mils of milk, that's like another... I want to say another 14 um, grams of protein, so that's pretty sweet, a pretty protein-packed and delicious meal. Uh, 0.04 grams of salt. There is literally nothing unnatural or bad in this box. Now, I would not recommend eating it on a daily basis unless you earn a hell of a lot of money than more money than I have ever done. But if you can get your hands on it, and you like to have cereal every now and then in between having like porridge and eggs and bacon and stuff then try this shit out. I'm, I'm gonna give a new rating system for when I do reviews um, I'm gonna call it you know the primal rating. Let's, let's stick with the Neanderthal theme, let's go primal rating and this is gonna get a 4 out of 5 on the primal scale okay that is a four out of five because it's delicious it's nutritious it's got nothing bad in but it isn't really great value it's a little bit on the steep side but as these kind of products get enjoyed by more people and become more mainstream they will inadvertently become cheaper so as soon as people start picking up 
you know, this stuff in the supermarket instead of the crap that everyone's eating at the moment, then it's going to come down in price and we'll be able to enjoy it more often. So, uh, yeah, four out of five on the primal scale. Check it out. It's a bit steep, but it is well worth it. It's delicious. It's not that sweet. It's just great stuff. So, uh, yeah, apologies to one of my subscribers. I know this video is made indoors, um, but I wanted to hit you up with a video today, and it is freezing cold outside. Disappointingly, my rings still have not arrived, although they were dispatched last night. So hopefully they'll arrive tomorrow. As soon as I get those, I'm going to be doing you some workout videos outside. So peace, guys. See you in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, and like this video up. See you next